Hello, I'm John Prophet, Director of Applications Engineering with Lumen, and I'm here today to talk about off-grid mode. The first step involves logging into your Lumen Energy Management portal. From there, you will have a few tabs to choose from. Today, we're going to focus on our Control tab. At the most basic level, we allow homeowners to remotely control circuits, turning them on and off as needed with a simple click of a button or swipe left. We also have the ability to create schedules to more effectively eliminate standby loads, conserve energy usage during peak time of use periods, or many other user preferences. The third tab within your control dashboard is modes, and this includes our recently introduced off-grid mode. It is here where circuits can be prioritized for backup and even shed during outages to better conserve or protect the battery's power output and energy capacity. So you'll notice here that we are currently connected to the grid. We've already created our off-grid mode and specified which loads should remain backed up during an outage and which loads should be disabled. This mode is now enabled but inactive as we're still connected to the grid. The moment Lumen senses a grid outage, which I will simulate by flipping the grid power to off, the off-grid mode begins to work. Loads are now being shed as you can see here in the bottom right-hand corner of the screen and the mode has switched to active. Changing tabs to consumption, we can now see the real-time effect of our off-grid mode on how energy use or power draw is happening within the home. As soon as Lumen senses the grid outage, the air conditioner, air handler, and water heater were all disabled, so as not to exceed the power output capabilities of the storage system. It is important to note that Lumen believes in the vision of dynamic and interactive backup, which means homeowners may interact with circuits during an outage and change priorities of their backed up loads based on their current preferences. So if you are entertaining or need access to some warmer water, you can begin trading circuits as you see fit to meet those current needs. When power is restored, all circuits return to their original state. That concludes our demonstration today. Thanks for joining us.